Uh, that was something. Uh, thoughts on the offensive line coming out of the spring? Um, man, we're going to be a really good group. Um, you know, I, I think today, just seeing our depth, um, you know, me working with Logan Tish, who's been our you know, second, third team left guard, um, you know, he gets his footwork down and he's he's playing for us. I mean, it, I think we're going to be really good. I think we're going to have a lot of depth, um, a lot of quality depth as well, not just, you know, guys that can stick in there and fill a position. I think we're going to have guys that can play, and um, I'm really excited. You know, we, uh, we all work hard. We all... We all want what's best for the team, and so I think that that's going to be something going into summer that's really going to propel us to be a better offensive line. Just because I know I don't have to worry about guys showing up, uh, showing up at workouts. You know, being a senior leader, I don't have to worry about them not being there. So that's something that kind of I think is going to help us be a lot better. You went into last summer thinking Isaiah Battle was going to be a starter, and then he's no longer on the team. As a team leader, how, what do you say to these offensive linemen to kind of keep them focused to to make sure they're here in August? Well, I mean, you know, it, you just gotta you just gotta keep keep getting them going. I mean, every day, you know, you gotta encourage guys, and it's you know, it's once again, it's not really that difficult with this group. You know, these guys are just a bunch of good bunch of good guys, and uh, I think we recruited well, recruited real good character. You know, as you hear Coach Winnie say all the time, and uh, I, don't, I don't think it's you know too hard. You know, nothing nothing against Isaiah. I mean, the guy, you know, he did what he had to do. And, and, um, you know, obviously it's, it's paying off for him, you know, he, he's, he's doing well. But um, I really think that, that this group is a good group of guys, and we just, we work, you know, we work every day. And, um, you know, no pout, and just, just get it going and, and work. And I think, you know, as, since I've been here, you know, I took last spring off, but this is the best spring I feel like, you know, this is the best I've felt coming out, you know, of a spring practice of the whole offensive line. I think that we're really, really sound, and we've got sound depth on the game. Is that the biggest difference in this offensive line now compared to like a couple of years ago? What you keep saying is everybody's kind of yeah. yeah, yeah, you know, there's there's not any there's not any people that's not willing to do work, you know. And it's not like it's been a room full of misfits, but you know, two or three guys can take a whole room down, and um, I don't think we have any guys like that anymore. I think we've got once again just a bunch of guys that'll work and work and work and want to listen, want to be coached. You know, I think we've had guys in the past. And didn't really want to be coached, wanted to do it their way, and that, that's not a problem with this group. And um, you know, and, and they they just they take their coaching, they, they learn, and they go, you know, they go forward. They don't they don't go backwards. Whether it be a guess. And I think that's another big thing for this group. Chemistry, you have a thought about that? Do you think it's where it was this time last year? Oh no, you know, well I, I took last year off, but you know, whenever I came in, I think I think it's better than it was. You know, whenever I came in there, so, I mean, that's like I was saying. I think this is. This is the best I've felt as an offensive line unit coming out of a, coming out of a spring. Uh, you know, we just got to two little things up. You know, now we're in the fine tuning, transforming our bodies. And I, I'm just really excited about this. Really, I mean, we're we're going to be really good. You know, we were really good last year, lost some really good people. But, you know, we, we just got guys that have, that have played, that know how the game works, and, um, you know, they're mean and nasty. That's what you want in offensive linemen. I think that that's really going to take us to the next level. When you hear Oh, man. Just, you know, trying to get that little more stronger, uh, get my body composition just right. You know, I mean, I've, I've gotten to a point now where, you know, there's not any big changes that I need to make. You know, I, I think that, you know, I've got my weight down. I'm down to about 306, 307, so that's not an issue. It's just, you know, really just trying to, once again, transform my body, turn, you know, that little bit more fat into muscle. Um, just really. Uh, mind and just making everything as perfect as I can make it. I think it's the biggest thing for me and what I'm going to focus on. Yeah, yeah, it's a lot different than last summer, you know, and I'm in a leadership role too, so I think that another priority is just, you know, making sure that not only am I getting other guys to come along with me, but, you know, I'm, I'm waking myself up every morning and, and, you know, doing what I need to do. So, um, I, you know, I think that's going to be a big key and, and, you know, just trying to develop leadership with other guys, you know, just not having me as the only one, but having, you know, Mitch step in there, or Tyrone, or, you know, Maverick, or um, just, I mean, because any of our, we've all got potential to be a leader. You know, we don't have, once again, we don't have any bad people that, you know, 
aren't can't leave. So I and that once again puts me in a good position. You can tell me whether I'm wrong or not. When you talk about the closeness of this group, I've heard the girlfriends even get together. Yes. yes I mean, how did that start? And, and you know, I mean, they're just they're just all. I don't know. I really don't know. I guess they just started talking to each other. I, and that's I guess it comes with us spending more time with each other. You know, we're with our girlfriends, and then they come along with us. And I guess that's just kind of and that you know they they want to see each other. So you know, we're not just hiding out in our in our rooms. With our, you know, we're, we're going out, and, and that really helps everybody kind of come together. And uh, it's really once again, it's just like a Clemson atmosphere, though. It's a Clemson family. We're all we all hang out. We all you know we, we have a good time together, and um, I think that's once again helped us you know in football too. So. What are some of the things you've just talked about how the chemistry has been there?